Did you know that you can create a very professional and fully functional website with just your smartphone in less than 30 minutes and sell to your clients and make as much as 150k to 500k per website depending on your agreement with your client? Are you in Nigeria, Ghana? Cameroon or any part of the world and you have been looking for your way to make cool money, then you are in the right place. As a freelance web developer, I have discovered that there have been an increase in the demand for investment websites, particularly in West Africa. Now in this video, I am going to teach you how to create a fully functional Bitcoin investment website with just your smartphone and no coding knowledge is required. And I won't just end here. Now stay with me because after this teaching, I have a huge offer for you which will show you how to get multiple clients for your new skill and how you can get all the tools needed for creating this website and many other types. So let's dive right into the tutorial. The very first thing you will need to do is purchase your hosting and domain account. I personally make use of Namecheap account. However, you can make use of any other hosting platform you prefer. And you're giving your cPanel login details. Just input the details, your username and password, then log in. Okay, so while you're waiting for the page to log in, once it opens, you go to your file manager, open it. Now, once you open your file manager, we're going to upload, go to public underscore HTML. So we're going to upload that file, the file I will give you the script. So you click on upload. Now you select the file, the script, I'll give you upload the script, the new bit script. Now once you wait, so while we are waiting, because it's going to take some time for it to upload. So let's um, create, let's create, um, let's go to this pix act. So we want to create the logo for the for the website that we're going to create. So let's create a logo. So it's going to be, yeah, we're going to use a width of 200 and 500. So we're going to create a logo for the website. The name of our website is new, no short profit. So going to create a logo so like you can see I'm using PixArt everything I'm doing is with my same phone just with my phone and I'm going to create the logo create everything and then once I'm done I'll save the logo and then I'll I'll go and check if it has um, finished loading in the script I finished uploading once it's done I will now continue to the next step okay So I've saved it. Okay, it has uploaded. It is it has finished uploading. It's green. So I will now check it. Open the file. You can see um, this file is there. So I'll extract it. So uh, you can see the file is there already. So you need to extract it. So you click on it. You right click and then you click on extract. So extract it now. Okay. Now, once you see it has been extracted, open the file, open the, the BTC file, now open the WebIT profile you see there. Now, once you open that file, open the file, now select all the files that are there. Click on select, select all the files, then move the file, move it directly under your public underscore HTML, okay? So remove everything and put it directly under your public underscore HTML. Okay, click on move file. It should be directly under your public underscore HTML. Move the files, everything you see there. Okay. 
Now, once you've moved it and put it directly on there, you're probably gonna square HTML. You go to your domain name, just search for your domain name, and you find out that your website is already live. Um, so, you're also going to do some small filling. Go online, just search for your domain name at once. Okay, Let's see, search for your domain name. So you see this installation guide here. So we need to fill our host name, the username, the password, and database name. But we don't have all these things yet. So we're going to go and create a database. So let's go back to the cPanel. Okay. Go to the cPanel, search for my SQL database. Okay. So once you search for my SQL database, open it. So we're going to create a database name. Um, database, let's call it DB. Okay, click next step database and then we now fill our username you can call it user usr and then you write whatever password you want to use now select generate the password now we'll click on it just keep your attention so I'm going to copy my password I've copied I'll paste it here in the, on a notepad then I'll go and copy it again copy my database and username once I copy them I also save them on the notepad so that I will be able to use it for my registration to, to install those the script Okay, I'll click, I've selected all, then I'll click next, okay. And that's it, my SQL database, I finally created a database. So here I'm going to write localhost. And the username, I'll go and take it. I'll get the username, copy it. Copy my username. And then I'll go back, paste it. The password, same thing, I'll copy the password. I'll go and copy my, let me copy my um, database name first. So, copy this, then. So, it's just very simple. Just paste it. And then, um, the password, copy the password. paste it to and that's all now you see it has successfully installed so open it load it again now can you see our site is live so you see all these things this is the front end all these things we can easily make changes on all this change all you see here our site is optionalized so let's go back to our C panel there's something that is very important that we need to do let's get back to our C panel so load it now go to your C panel go to that file manager and um, now you see on in, in on that public underscore HTML where our files are you see a file called install install you can see this install file delete it it's very important make sure you delete it okay delete it okay now go back here now you can click on create account so let's go to login and let's write our the email address which i will send to you so you can easily log in so let's see our admin so this is our admin dashboard so this is the admin dashboard of the website see everything is working so perfectly everything is so good all this has been done with our phone we worked on it so let's see the dashboard it's our investment plan no i've done no, i've not yet added investment plan or anything it's our email template and everything you can make changes with email um, how you want email format to be let's go to the settings and start making some changes that are required in the setting so let's change our the company name to our company that we are working with now so like i said this is all done with our phone you can see it change the company now 
company email address so we don't have an email address here so let's go to cpanel and create an email address that we'll put here okay check for email and then we add our email address so create email address you enter let's use the support as our username enter your password I'll copy the password and I'll also save it here for future purpose. Okay, so I'll click read. Mm -hmm. Now I'm done. I'll go now back and you can see my email address. I'll go back and change it to the company's email address copy it and paste it on the company email address so that is then the company url i'll just copy the url that you can find here copy it so the company url I'll paste it here then after that I'm to feel I'm to upload our logo so that logo that we just did initially I'm to upload them so I'll just click on it this we have the logo already available so I will upload it so just like that I have all the two type of logo blue dark and white logo so we don't have a favicon one is lacking a favicon so I'll let me go back to my pics at and I will need to work on a favicon. Okay, so let me work a favicon. It's supposed to be a square favicon. So let me make it with 200 and height 200. So square. I'm going to work on the favicon. Okay, I'm done with my favicon. I'm going to save it, and then let me open the favicon, choose the file now, and upload it. And now I can save it. Enter my password. successfully you see i've reloaded the page and you can see the logo has appeared already up there and everywhere the logo is required to be it has appeared so my logo is now on my website you can see the front end everything the logo is there everything so we're going to make changes on these pages we can change all the right up here but before that i will show you something else for make changes on everything i'll show you how to make changes Let's make some settings. Let's make some changes on the settings. Let's, you can see the image settings should be like this. See all the details are there. Make sure you have the details in this manner. Okay. And then the you can earnings, you can also change it as you want. Let's work on payment method. You see the, the website comes with so many payment methods. So we can make changes. Let's work on Bitcoin payment method first. And it is both automatic and you can also make it manual but i want to do manual for now so and just do some notes for the investor okay make sure you put down your actual btc wallet so that it will reflect to the user and then I will sell a B arrow, this uh, use B arrow so that you can put it on another line. Okay. And you save it. So this becomes active. So the Bitcoin wallet is active. You can see it's active. The other rest are still inactive. You 
you can delete them you can you activate them there are multiple payment methods so many you can see them pay up pay stack yes it is so many payment methods that you want all the type of payment method and you can see add extra payment method if you want so you see the site is very well robust it has all the features you will need for an investment website every future that you will need so let's make changes on the front end. You see, we went to template, so we can make all the changes on the front end here now. See, let's make changes. We can change it to our name, change it to the name for the website. We can also change even the sign up button. We can change everything. We can even decide changes to register. But I want to leave it to sign up for now. can see everything you can change it every single thing here you can change make changes everywhere In the writings you can change every single thing you change everything so even our packages you can here too you can change every single thing you can see that everything on this front end can change here so once you're done making the changes just click on here save click here and it saves okay so once you save mm -hmm. we are done with the template so we are click on save Go to terms and condition under terms and condition we can also change uh, everything we can write our own terms and condition you can make the changes that you want so that the user can see the terms and condition before signing in the privacy policy for your company you can make all the changes for your private policy for your company and uh, every single thing can be done you see this is a very complete website it has every single thing you need even our uh, frequently asked question for the users you can write a question and an answer every single thing here can be done and then that's it Okay. let's go you, you see the front end see, uh, see the changes have reflected already on the front end so any change you make will just reflect immediately every changes okay all right at this point let's go to the dashboard and then we are going to go to in the investment plan let's create our investment plans that the user will see and that will also reflect on the front end. Let's make a plan name. Let's give it call it basic. And then let's maybe just use an investment of hundred dollars minimum and maximum. Let's say fifty dollars. And mine is even hundred dollars. Let's give it a profit of one percent and interest period of see you can choose so many interest period. You can also change this, choose of you see everything, and you click save. Mm -hmm. So we've just created our first plan. You can create other multiple plans you want. Create all of them. Let's call second standard. create as many many plans as you want so let's go front end and then you see our investment plans they have already reflected on our front end immediately all of them premium that's it basic and standard you see 
everything has reflected everything is working now let's log out and go to our user dashboard so we can sign in as let's create an account and sign in as a user so we can be able to access the user dashboard and see how a user can log in because we are done with all the details for our um all the details for our admin dashboard is already ready so let's sign in as a user create an account so you can see Here is the user dashboard, very clean and clear user dashboard. So the user can deposit, you can view deposit, can withdraw, you can earn, and can even ask for help. So here we will create a payment method. There are so many payment methods here. So you you can delete some. You can add some through the admin dashboard. The user will need to input his um, account, that is his address, this kind of address. Uh, that he wants to receive payments from so all those that's why he inputs his own bitcoin address and then maybe that's how he sets up the payments accounts and then let's now go and request for deposit money so he, he can see all our preferred investment packages are there he selects bitcoin because it's only bitcoin with um available for now so he selects hundred dollars let's input there now if you put your address it will immediately appear here he can easily scan this and uh, it will reflect he can just scan it and send the payment directly or he can just copy the address if you input your address on the user on the admin dashboard you can just scan it and everything will be working perfectly and that's just it you see everything here is very top-notch and robust very good and flexible you can so that how he deposits phone and then see he can also withdraw phones he can also view phones check his earning see the place for his earning he can also this way he receives and so everything is very very on point very simple and very easy to walk around with okay so yeah he can even send referral link to other email address and he can do everything so this is it right now you've just been fully equipped with the necessary skill you need to start making money by creating this website like i said in the beginning i won't just end there i have a five star package for you an investment pro package in this package you will have three professional investment scripts with modern functionality that is the script I used in this tutorial and two other modern professional scripts. Two, you also have 20 different front-end templates you can use for your website. Three, a video and guide on how to get multiple clients that are willing to pay you a good amount of money to create this type of website for them. 24-7 support system and you can call or chat this number on whatsapp at any time of the day for support and i respond swiftly five free updates on new scripts strategies and opportunities and the price for this package is 150,000 naira However, it is actually 20,000 Naira just for the first 100 people that will purchase this package right now. And after this, it will go back to the original price of 150K. So chat me up right now if you need the script, you will succeed.